Hey guys, it's me Nicole and welcome back to another video here on True Company's YouTube channel. I am so beyond excited to do this video because if you guys watched our video last Friday where we are giving away a Kiko Milano eyeshadow palette, then you'll know that I really like the Kiko products and of course I wanted to try out more while I'm here still in Italy. So I went to the Kiko store and I picked up some lippies and I am so excited to be trying these products out. Oops. They are four different formulas, four different colors, some bright, some nudie, some dark colors. You know, I'm just super excited to try this out. This one. <laughs> so the first lippy that I kind of like gravitated towards too, because I know a lot of people like these kind of like nudie colors was just this creamy um, lipstick formula. And it comes in this really cool packaging. You actually press this button here and then it comes out. And yeah it's super pretty looking like it's just like this nudie color and yeah I am super excited to try this out because I normally don't wear lipsticks I normally wear like a liquid lipstick or gloss so I thought that maybe I would try out a creamy lipstick and see how this works for me and then of course I picked up this gloss and oh my gosh like the camera's not doing it justice at all but it is so so sparkly and I just absolutely love it. I'm going to put some shots in after of all the lipsticks kind of like with a nicer background so you guys can really focus on those. So maybe you guys will be able to see the sparkles. But yeah, I love lip glosses. So of course I picked up this super pretty lip gloss. And my boyfriend actually picked this one up because he just loves sparkly things on me. So yeah. That's why I got this one. Next product I got was this matte liquid lipstick and it comes in this really nice packaging. I feel like you could like slip this in your pocket or like in one of your purse pockets and yeah, it's just really nice looking and it looks really good comparing to like the price. So it doesn't look like super cheap. It feels pretty heavy like this is glass and yeah, so I got this really cool like kind of like dark, I don't even know what to call it. like. It doesn't have a name on it, it's literally called O3, but yeah, it's kind of like a dark, plummy, vampy kind of color, and I swatched this, and it does turn out a little bit darker than in the tube, and yeah, I'm just super excited to try this out, and I thought I would pick up a darker one, because this will really test and see how this matte formula really is. If I got a lighter color, I felt like it would kind of be unfair to test it out, so yeah, that's why I picked up this one. Last, but certainly not least, I picked up this bright, bright, bright orange liquid lipstick. It's just so bright, and I never go for things like this, but I thought maybe an orange lipstick would be kind of cool to try out since I don't own any. But basically on one end, it's the liquid lipstick, and on the other end, it's a gloss. So I thought that was super cool because you're able to, you know, either wear a liquid lipstick alone, or if you want to stick a gloss on that's super clear and won't really change the color, but give that really nice glossy effect, then this is a perfect product. So yeah, I'm just going to throw in some nice shots of these colors so you can really see them and then we'll jump into me swatching these colors out for you. So this is the first color. They feel super, super nice on the lips since it is a creamy lipstick. I feel like it would look a lot better if I was wearing a lip liner because this is such a light pink. Like. I think it looks really pretty though. I literally don't have any colors like this, so I found a nice color that's comfortable. It adds a little 
a little soft pink look to my lips and yeah I think it's really nice to be honest when I first put it on it looked kind of dry which sounds weird since it is a creamy lipstick but when you rub your lips together like this it somehow like smooths it out it makes it look super nice which is kind of weird but I'm okay with that This lip gloss is so, so pretty. It's such a nice pinky, like, kind of nudey, like, darker color. It kind of reminds me of the Fenty lip balm. No. What's it called? The Fenty glow bomb? Fenty gloss bomb? I forgot what it's called. But anyway, it reminds me of that product, which I absolutely love. But it is a little bit more expensive, so this is kind of cool because I think I found a dupe for the gloss bomb. Oh my god, it's just so pretty. It's so sparkly. Wow. I'm digging this a lot. So this lipstick is such a nice color, oh my god it's so pretty. I don't have a color like this so this is really really nice. It's transfer proof and oh it's such a nice color, wow it literally makes me feel like a vampire. I really like it with this black dress and like my dark hair, I think it's kind of cool. Of course, it did take me a little bit longer to put on, but that's just because um, I don't have a lip liner for this type of color, and it is a liquid lipstick, so I really want to be careful. I didn't do the best job applying it, but it's not the absolute worst. So overall, I really, really love this color. The formula is really comfortable. like It's really, really nice. It makes my teeth look nice and white. I love it. So guys, I know you just saw me swatch this lipstick, but when I put my lips together, they literally got stuck and the lips got so messed up. It looks so horrible and if you can see right now, my lips are a mess. I had to stick this lip gloss on it because, oh my gosh, this literally just probably took me like a good 15 minutes and like three no, I have two of these wipes here to get it off, and I still have some random orange things. 
I do not like the formula of this matte lipstick whatsoever. I think it honestly might be because, be because, sorry, I literally can't talk because I can't fill my mouth because it's burning so much. But anyway, I think it might be because of the color. And I'm really hoping it is because this is such a cool idea. But like, this does not apply evenly. It doesn't look good. It gets sticky and gloopy and uneven and... You know what? I'm not putting it on again. I'm not doing that. I'm really sad that this didn't work out because it's so cool, but let me just take off this gloss and I'll just try this gloss on the end to see how it is because, you know, it's so cheap that I would totally go out and try a different color and see if it did the same thing. But, um, oh, I dropped it. Mm. But yeah, that was a horrible experience. I'm just gonna stick this gloss on this end on my lips and see how it looks because Wow, I really like this gloss a lot. It looks really really nice. It's so nice because there's no sparkles or like color to it. Oh my gosh, I really like this. But yeah, that concludes the end of this video. I loved these three. I thought they worked out really, really, really nice. I love the gloss, I love this color, and I really like this creamy lipstick as something really simple to put on, but this is a definite Pass. I am never putting that orange on my lips ever again. That wraps up this video. I don't know what I'm doing. I think it's my lips are in shock, so it's like making me act a little crazy. But yeah, that concludes the end of this try on video. These are hits. That is a definite miss. But guys, we are going to be doing something super fun in this video, just like the previous one last Friday on the Kiko Milano eyeshadow palettes we are going to be giving away some lippy products we'll make sure not to be giving away that orange because I do not want you guys to go through what I just went through but definitely a gloss will be in there a matte liquid lipstick couple lipsticks oh my gosh I'm so excited for you guys to try them out I really really like them the packaging so cute like I said everything turned out really nice and yeah I'm just gonna forget about that orange and focus on the positives all you have to do to enter this giveaway is the same as our previous giveaways of course like this video subscribe to our channel and leave a positive comment down below it can be emojis, it can be something like a question or maybe even a video suggestion, just any sort of little comment and make sure that you follow our Instagram which will be in the description down below. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!